everybody. Yeah, my first 3D um, thing here. Um, this is a, uh, I'm going to say like a Kodak film I got for Christmas here. Um, and yeah, Jack the Bomb, John, yeah, you got your Sony uh, Handycam here. And uh, sometimes like YouTube, some, um, the first time I did it here, um, yeah, really? Um, <laughs> yeah, um, <laughs> sorry here. It's uh, pretty good. Uh, yeah, your systems are pretty good here. And um, see, yeah, it's my new HD camera. So we're, at least we're um, at HearthSense right now. We are. Um, we are, we both now are recording HD videos, and uh, maybe I'll hopefully I'll get a Sony Handycam um, later this year. Maybe on the next generation is coming out. Um, the iPad 3. Um, he's gonna get an iPad 3 here. And first of all, I'm going to talk about a new, new pickup here, and, um, and yeah, I have honor of, um, uh, Buckner and Garcia's death here. I got the new Pac-Man Fever. Um, it was, it was kind of promising, the way I look at the artwork, it's, as you can see, um, this is the original Pac-Man Fever and an LP, which I got here. Uh, uh, way ago on eBay, as you can see, the Pac-Man Fever on the LP it has the screenshot of a game, and so I was thinking, like, hey, I can actually be able to um, have the original recordings now on CD. Nope. Um, I got the new original Pac-Man Fever because. Um, I was hopeful for that. And plus, it got the two new songs in the thing. It's got uh, the new ET, uh, "I Love You," and "Hostage." And uh, but and yes, believe it or not, this is what the first one here, the LP one. I remember, I remember getting this one here a little ago. The um, second one, the hey, I re release it. Uh, but oh no, it's re recordings. The one that got here. So uh, this came out. Um, so I, hey, I'm going to buy it in excitement. It's going to be, um, pretty good. Believe me, it's, nope. People are going to be saying, well, it's the original recordings of the things. Nope, it's the 1999, um, re-recordings of the things. So I was pretty disappointed about this here, but, I mean, it's still got the, um, it has two additional tracks on it here for, hey, you can get the uh, two free songs in the CD here. Yeah, I ripped it. Um, but I didn't like it. Such a disappointment here. And, um... Oh, man. Um, that's what I have to say about it. So, in other words, um... If you want Pac-Man Fever, I just say go on eBay and try um, to look and try to get this uh, version here on the 1982 um, CBS here. And uh, yeah, CBS, uh, Sony, or whatever you, uh, the company you're holding this one here, please. Um, I want we want the original recordings here. It's time for you to stop sitting on these recordings. I mean, it's I mean um, the way you're doing it. I'm surprised you haven't sued Buckner and Garcia for, hey, we're going to make, make, make great recames. Oh, you're going to have a new copyright claim or like this here. And, um, yeah, CBS, um, Sony, which is now owned by Sony now, uh, BMG, and they're the owners of the copyrights. They're just so idiots that don't want to, you know, they're just so scummies that, oh, we're not going to sell the original recordings ever again. And, um... This leads to this um, another rant here. This uh, this also goes back to the you know, Atari's rant here. And Atari, you are saying, oh, we are wanting to protect uh, intellectual properties and uh, physical hands here. Oh yeah, so you want to be able to you know have support in the indie developers, but oh, f you, I'm going to screw over the indie developers for creating even such remotely a, rem a resemblance of the game. Now, excuse me, Atari. You, I mean, copyright tools are a freaking problem in this country, and just in this society here. We got plenty of copyright trolls, um, and we got plenty of copyright trolls that want to take down, take you down for just creating 
a, um, oh, we're just creating a uh, very same plans of your works. Hey, I mean, Atari, why don't you just, uh, why don't you just, uh, s I mean, if that's the case, um, hey, um, if you, uh, this is goes to EA, and you're, exclusive license and you just want to be able to turn an emergency extension of your copyright works when you that says here I mean this is why does this world coming to here and EA has been an online pass and saying hey look you buy used games I will punish you <laughs> and you punish you to the think that back to that um, say this is like <laughs> punish me for what we have done for the past um, 30 or 40 years and say hey um the PC games, I mean, um, remember the good old PC games of X-Wing? You can actually be able to buy this thing used because, I mean, I can, I can sure you can have, um, um, you can buy it from eBay, X-Wing for TIE Fighters and like this here. Oh yeah, but EA and big companies just want to screw you, screw us over. And, um, that's what I have, that's what I have to say. And, you know, speaking of used games, I'm going to have to go over to Microsoft here. Uh, a, a, pers a response to many, many, many videos in this one here. Um, John and Jack the Bomb is saying, oh, it's going to come in, it's going to come in here. Yeah, I'm going to have to criticize on this one because really, this is unacceptable and we're going to have to stop. And if Microsoft, and the bullcrap Microsoft's being pulling on us here for r latest rumors here, we need to speak up now. We need to speak up for to keep our rights we've been ha asking for the past um, since the Nintendo or Super Nintendo came out. I mean, um, I, I mean, I, I, the days I've gone to Fungaland, I was go, I was purchasing 8-bit NES and Super NES games like this. I go into Fungaland, and then um, the days when I'm going to Babbage's and Fungal Land, I can be able to pre-purchase, you know, use N64 games that I've missed before. And, um, that can be able to do that today. But the recent bullcrap is Microsoft, but, uh, but Microsoft is saying, Stop. Halt. You. For, you know, I will put, I am going to put you in protection here. says, hey look, we're bleeding because of used game sales. It's worse than piracy. Microsoft, are you out of your freaking mind? Are you out of your mind that we that you're going to take our beloved stuff away that we've been doing for the past um, 30 years? Okay, I have a quiz question, quiz question here. Used games were pretty good back in the 1990s and, two, and, and, and uh, 1990s and like this. Did the video game industry collapsed when used games were um, looking pretty good, where people were swapping and trading games on the older games. No. Can there be a used game without new games being purchased? Hmm, you want to ask me the answer the questions? Can there be 32,000 used game sales and only one game purchased new? Well, there could be a couple of three of them, or even that. It could be the costing you about hundreds of thousands of dollars, and it could be uh, so much unaffordable like this. You want to answer that question, uh, publishers? I mean, what the freak? Oh goodness sakes! Here, I mean, you can still, I mean, you can still buy this used today. A Pac-Man Fever. Hey, look! You can buy. You can still buy this on eBay and enjoy the original recordings in there. You can, you can just buy in any record player, uh, hook up to your PC, record it, and put it on MP3 like this. Um, what is it coming down to, area? What what is it coming down to, publishers that want to you know mess around with the industry and probably have control? Um, we're going to release it, but we're not going to release it um, again here. You want to, I mean, um, I was gladly, dearly begging you to release, to re-release this on the original recordings, but hell, you don't want to do that because you're so greedy. And um, either that or you want to be able to, you know, what the freak, man, Microsoft? 
I mean, Alpha Omega Sin, um, Alpha did it. His friends had made, posted a video here. And yeah, I actually, um, I, I actually, you know, sent a message to John Jack the Bomb about this, of how disappointed I am. If that's the case, Microsoft, if you want, if you want to lock down your systems, screw the, screw the 720. And Sony, um, you, if you want to be able to lock down your PS4 about this, screw you. I'm going to be done with consoles. I mean, you got to understand. I mean, um, you, you got to understand. Used games do not kill an industry. Used cars were a predominantly sale today. Did you think that um, the car industry still exists today? And look, if I want to be able to trans if I want to give me a kid my keys, um, like um, I bought a car, they gave me the key title and the keys to the car. Okay. Um, okay. Here's how it's worse in the online pass. Uh, well, supposing that you have a dashboard, you put a key in your car, but oh no no no, we have to put the fingerprint on this one, and then it says I'm um, to start here. Um, okay, this 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 is the same thing as putting a fingerprint um, marker here. It says, oh, in order here to start the car, you have to put the fingerprint, um, or you have to phone Toyota for it. Say, can I have a permission to start your car for one day or like this? And Toyota says, are you the original owner? And yeah, you lied to him. Says yes. So um, I want you to prove the original ownership. Press your car keys down here. And, uh, um, you're not the original owner. Sorry, you can't drive the freaking car. Suppose if I, suppose if my car breaks down, my mother uh, or my brother decides to uh, have him borrow the car for a couple of days, but Toyota, wanna, want, Toyota wants to be a-holes, and, um, they're saying, only your brother can drive the car, and he has no rights to give, uh, no rights to give it away. And, 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 and Oh, you can't buy used cars anymore. So Toyota said, and also uh, going back to oh God, man. So my brother um, wants me to borrow my car, and and so it's so okay. Here's the keys. Here's the car. I tried to start it up, but it gives me eh eh. You're the original order. I can't start the engine. Oh yeah. So you want to be able to. So you want to be able to don't give a crap about your customers, and we're going to shoot down the used car business here. Oh, you can't buy used cars anymore. You, uh, I mean, I can't buy a used Chevy 1990, 1989 Chevy Celebrity before. Chevy Celebrity. Oh, I can't buy that because that thing's locked down. This car is useless now. It's broken. Oh, the engine still works, but I just can't start it up because it has some, some stupid protection on it. It's going to ruin the... Um, and, and let's apply this to games. Uh, back to games. I mean, it's going to ruin the history of uh, video games. I mean, um, go to. I mean, go to Alpha Make a Sense on this on this latest um, things here. Um, hey, yeah, I can't play this record because I'm not the original owner. Um, what the freak? The music industry is, you know, oh yeah, uh, um, the CD sales are down. Oh yeah, it's not because of the, uh, the CD sales are down and the MP3 sales are up. Oh yeah, it's not because, you know, um, I stick with, I still stick with CDs today. Um, because I feel that, you know, MP3 downloads are just not worth it to me. I mean, if you're just getting a, some, a digital download copy here. Yeah, I still stick with CD, CDs. I just got this, um online today and um, see this is the thing here but yeah really Microsoft you want to be able to be an a-hole and say yo you can't resell your freaking games look I'm sorry Microsoft screw the 720 I just I don't care about you anymore hey if you want to be able to put if you want people to pull stuff if you want to be able to pull any more stuff to our, our society look screw Windows 8 screw Microsoft Word um, yeah, my computer, uh, my computer, I might just install Linux on my computer. I'm going to install WordPerfect, or um, I might I, I might install Corel stuff. Like, you know, WordPerfect. Um, they're going to flock away from you. 
the other, the, 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 uh, I mean, if you screw customers like this here, uh, people are going to say, F you, bye bye, I'm just going to do something else that's fun. Like being a retro gamer. Um, uh, uh, being a retro gamer. I mean, I go back to my Ape Nintendo. I like to go back to my Atari 2600. The Atari 2600. The Nintendo 64. The PlayStation 1 as a retro gamer. Look, you don't need to support Xbox. You don't need to support the 720 and their bullcrap to be a gamer. I mean, um, you can go, um, you, you can, um, I mean, you can just, I mean, I'll just go back to my PlayStation 1. I can go back to my Nintendo 64. Hey, look, um, you pop in a game in, of course it's going to work. Um, you can buy, you, you, uh, you can, yeah. Of course it's going to work. You can't stop me from buying a Nintendo 64 game. You can't buy me for buying it. For, you can't stop me for, for um, playing a PS1 game. But for the recent bullcrap that, hey, um, what are you going to do next, Microsoft? What are you going to do next, Sony? Are you going to sue eBay? Are you going to sue every single person in the world here who sells used games now? Look. This is how it's killing the industry. This is how it's, you know... You can't collect... I mean, hey! <laughs> oh yeah, I bought this from eBay, uh, like I use things. Why don't CBS sue me now? And the latest of the act of treatment here, I mean, it's, I think it's most likely because of publishers... Um, <sighs> it's because of, you know, publishers that, I think it's most likely, it's, it's going gonna, it's gonna to favor the publishers. I mean, Microsoft's closing up to the publishers. And yes, Microsoft um, says, oh no, we're not going to sell rented games to Netflix. Oh no, it's too, it's too evil for us because people are going to rent the game, play it once, and hey, I don't have to pay any more money. So hey, why don't, oh, so hey, why don't we just change this into a deal? Where we cannot buy a used game, um, so hey, you buy a new game, it's stuck, it sucks, you're stuck with it. I mean, oh my god, man. And for people who are saying, oh, huh, you're expected for this one. This is what I'm not expecting, Microsoft. You lock the games down, you screw me over, I'll screw you over. This is the, and that's all I have to say about this. Microsoft made buying through a 720. That's it. JD out.